we got Hexolano Pulse a lot at stake hex five 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 five. Make sure you're following her on Twitter. She said, um, quote, quote, tweeting Mr. Whale will chart.org. So quote t- tweeting Mr. Whale said, Patrick Hillman, director of strategy at Binance, said that the company may cease to exist in 10 years because the cryptocurrency market is moving towards DeFi. Interesting. That is interesting. And then um, Hexalana Pulse Lot responds, repeat what visionary genius founder philanthropist Richard Hart what said years ago. Without repeating the exact words Richard Hart said years ago. And now you believe you came up with the brilliant concept all by yourself instead of where it actually came from, which was always Richard Hart, LOL, lols. Yeah, I mean, Richard Hart was really ahead of the curve when it came to when it came to uh, DeFi. When it came, he was the first uh, founder to really throttle mainstream adoption of decentralized exchanges. It, there was a point where they were the majority of, uh, I believe the majority of uh, trading volume on Uniswap. And then that's really where, it, that's really what throttle it to what we see it is today. Um, does that mean that, and then obviously you have Hex, which is DeFi at its purest, you know, no middlemen, uh, trustless yield. Um, and uh, yeah, you get to keep your keys. You get to keep your keys. You get to earn yield. You get to delay gratification. You get to, which drives the price up, which gets you to benefit from those multiples uh, that are to be had in the future because you're forced to delay gratification. You're not going to get shaken out when the price goes too high or the price goes too low. So uh, that's, that's a, yeah, that's one of the most, I think it's the most innovative thing in crypto that in decentralized exchanges for uh, this past bull market. But does that mean that Binance may cease to exist in 10 years? I mean, it may cease to exist <laughs> because of uh, shenanigans that they're doing, but is it going to cease to exist because, because DeFi will uh, essentially make it obsolete? Uh, I'm not too sure about that. I think that there is always going to be need for a centralized exchanges because, again, it really does connect the fiat world. You know, it connects the fiat with uh, crypto. It's the uh, it's the bridge, so to speak. Unless you want to argue that eventually the fiat, you know, uh, traditional finance will become obsolete um, and it'll be taken over by decentralized finance. I think to an extent it will, but I, I don't I don't know if it'll I don't know if it'll be completely decentralized because you're always going to have like these third parties like these stable coin companies to back your um, stable coin one to one to ensure it has a peg. So, I mean, there's that. Unless they can maybe implement some sort of bridge from the uh, traditional finance, you know, where it gets it gets locked up and then trustlessly mints a token to back. I think True USD is sort of like that. So I don't know. Maybe we'll see. Or maybe these uh, these uh, centralized exchanges will move more towards DeFi. Who knows? But yeah, that's that is interesting. Richard Hart is always he has always been ahead of the curve. He was in Bitcoin in 2011. He has been. And now, uh, and now he's been on, uh, he's been on, he's been on Uniswap. You know, he kind of was the visionary that was able to see, that was able to see that that was actually, in fact, the future of crypto and obviously created Hex. So he's always been ahead of the curve. That is another thing that really reassures me that we're in a good place because we have a founder that's always thinking a couple steps ahead. So yeah, that's what I think about that. We got 16 watching. What's going on, guys? Thanks for tuning in. If you're enjoying, please hit the like and subscribe. And uh, please, if you can, go to the description. Give me a follow on Twitter. I mean, go go to the description, click the link for my email list, and just put your email down. I'd really, really appreciate that.